Hello, welcome back to Nick2340. Um, here we have a 1952 Ford Crestline Victoria. Uh, this was pretty much like the top of the line car from back in 1952. And I was here back in November, I mean, uh, December and August. So I have this car in both videos, but we'll see it again. So why not? This car here is my dream car, really 52 Ford. Um, it's just such a shame to see it just sit like this. It's got factory air in it. It's nice factory air. 1952 factory air. Would have had a flathead V8 in it. That's gone. Ford Crestline V8. It's got wheels on it. I don't know how old those tires are though. We got the door handle here. Inside. This a really nice car. This one here. It's got the Ford on there. It's a Rambler hubcap. Just left of the seats. It's left of the seats. Move this cave in. Unfortunately. The parking brake thing in it. Uh, this uh, this was a manual transmission car. Three on the tree. Stick on the column pretty much. Um it's so much left on the inside. A lot of good parts though. We'll say that. Miles of this thing. This thing did eighty-nine thousand fifty-eight thousand nine hundred fifty-five miles. That could be one hundred fifty-eight thousand miles though. So, I'd say, I'd say, gold emblem. Cool. Here's the back of it. This car here was at W.A. Wills Pueblo. So if you guys know what that dealer is, comment down below. I'm sure they're out of business now. The tail lights, tail lights are in great shape. And stuff, bumper guards, look at this. So the gas cap is, it's a trunk lock. Let's take a look at the trunk, shall we? The roomy trunk. It's got the sticker still. Look at that. Ford hubcaps. Man. Those. They're like in good shape, too. This car's got a lot of stuff to it still. I hope this is something. Ford emblems missing. A dent in it right there, unfortunately. Unfortunately, this thing's got killer patina to it, though. If you're someone that likes patina on a car, it's so perfect on this one. Let's take a look at this side. And this one's got floor deletes in it, meaning floor pans are bad. As expected, though, this car is in Wisconsin, so. These classics don't hold up well. No cars do, actually. If this car was in Arizona, it'd be solid as a rock, most likely. But this ain't Arizona. This is the Midwest. This is Wisconsin. Salty roads. Snowy every year. So, makes sense. This trim's kind of coming out. Crestline V8. Actually says that in the dash. Look at that. Victoria. Ford was trying to tell you that this was a top of line car. V8 press line. I couldn't get the glove box open. No keys to this car, so that's why it's locked too. Really cool car. There's the locks in here. Really cool. Man, if only this car could go back on the road again. I would just make my day. The bumper's kind of bent up there. It's really nice looking car when it was brand new. Really nice looking car. Hopefully someday this one can be saved and not go to the junkyard. Anyways, thank you for watching. Comment, like, and subscribe what you think about this car. Would you save it? Would you not? Would you junk it? Would you part it out? I'd like to hear it down in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you at the next video.